Hello. Okay, well, I wanted to um, just show you guys and give you the recipe to um, this egg butter egg butter magic smoothie combination. So, if we look at this jar, I have adjusted the recipe a little bit um, because I still don't have raw butter. Um, okay, so first thing I did was I put, I juiced one lemon, juiced one lemon, and I put it at the bottom of this jar, and then on top of that I put, um, I cracked three eggs into it. I put a whole small avocado actually, so that is, normally there would be more butter, um, but I put a whole avocado in, three eggs, then I put probably like three or four tablespoons of butter into it, which I have been leaving out, out of the fridge so that it stays um, a little bit softer so that I can use it. And I found a place next to the window where it actually stays sort of like in between fridge and other temperature. And then I actually have almost a whole banana in here too because I'm trying to make it airtight. I'm trying to get all the way to the top. And then I have about a teaspoon and a half of um, of like oga honey. Super yummy. So the lemon and the honey help to pre-digest the, um, the egg and the butter for us. And my friend Larian from New York, um, he walked me through this whole procedure just a couple nights ago on his, we were Skyping so he could show me how to do it. So anyway, if you have, if you have a regular blender, this is like a pretty, pretty cheap, um, pretty cheap blender. Okay, so you know how you have the base of the blender? Well, there's this really magic thing that you can actually you can actually use a mason jar instead of instead of that regular that regular blender container. So here's the here's the regular the regular thing that goes on the base, and you know how. Well, A, it's mixing with air, which makes things, which makes this particular combination more difficult to digest. Um, but it also wastes so much on the sides, you know, and you have to transfer containers, and then you have to watch, wash more. So watch this. Okay, so we've got our, we've got our almost to the top, and we shove in the, in the blender base, and you have this little cute little blender container and then um, if your butter is really cold you're going to want to put this in a bath, a warm water bath for a little while. Um, but my, water, my butter should be okay and I prefer it to not be as runny. It makes like a perfect custard, um, perfect custard thing. So then like you literally only have to Do a little bit of pulsing. And then voila. Voila. Totally done. And all you do is unscrew the top. <laughs> and you have this amazing, amazing custard. Amazing raw. Mmm, it is so good. If you want a little bit less lemon, you could do like half a lemon. And if you want to skip the avocado, that's good. And Larian recommends, um, Larian recommends actually, and this is what Aginus says, you actually would prefer to have an unripe banana piece. I guess it's just better for your digestion in some ways and better for going with these other ingredients and you don't need to have a whole banana but that's the thing is I'm just I'm improvising because I'm trying to fill this whole jar so that it can be airtight and now I have like uh, here's my breakfast lunch 
Um, it just has so much nutrients and so much awesome fat. It really, um, you could break this up into three or four servings if you wanted. I tend to just um, keep eating it until it's gone because it's so delicious and, um, and my body wants it. So experiment and see what you come up with. Another awesome idea was when I didn't have lemon or if I don't have enough lemon or if I want to add something, I add a drop of um, the doTERRA Citrus Bliss or doTERRA Lemon or doTERRA Wild Orange. Here's Wild Orange. Oh my goodness. It's so good and it actually will will do the same thing and help improve the digestion of everything. So, And it's super delicious. Um, so thank you and I hope that you enjoy the recipe and I'd love to hear um, if it comes out for you. Love you.